Hello and welcome everyone to Kingdom, aka Virginia. This is, uh, this is a game where you play an FBI agent trying to solve a crime and freaky deaky shit goes on. Yeah, we had a better intro for this. But... I mean, you might get a sneak peek at it. I might, like, pause and then just be like, here was what we said originally. Or just cut it. I don't know. I'll but... figure out something. But let's, let's resume. 505 games. Let's, uh, let's crack on with uh, <laughs> with Virginia and see what this thing's about. Fuck. <laughs> so, from what I understand, you are an FBI agent and you're hunting for this uh, kid or something? Something like that. I don't remember if that was exactly it. I, I just remember you're an FBI agent on a case in this place and weird shit happened. Okay. Oh, yeah. Look at that topped out 30 frames per second. Oh, yeah. During the summer of 1992, the FBI editor took an investigation of the small town in Virginia based on the official record of the events the following story, blah, blah, blah. So apparently this is based off of a real story. I I have my reservations. Well, it's kind of like Fargo. It was based off of a real story. Very, very loosely. Very loosely. In the sense that something happened indeed at one time. Yeah. At one time, there was a light. Then there wasn't a light. So they went to check why there wasn't a light anymore. Aliens! <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's quite a leap. Well, I mean, that's the Steven Spielberg role, you we know? We've pretty much established that we are the worst FBI agents. If the wolf among us has anything to tell us, we're the best. Um, <laughs> meh? I mean, I, I, there's, there's ones on TV that do worse than us. That is true. <laughs> but they are on television. Yeah, and they get paid to suck. We don't. I mean, speak for your well, Your weekend activities don't count. Hey. <laughs> I just... Hey! You're gonna throw yeah. that out there. Yeah. Give them the number yeah. so that I can get some more business. Listen, I'm trying. Fucking hell, this music is loud as balls. Right, like, this music's like really over. First impressions of Virginia. Super overwhelming orchestral <laughs> scores. Fucking melodrama. Um, like, it, it conjures certain images, and I'm gonna kind of be a little disappointed. If it's not grand? If it's not, there's a certain, there's not a certain aspect of a grandiose nature like, to, to roll in. Ooh, this was made using Unity. I just feel like after this lead up, and they start with, like, Ma'am, where's the French toast? I'm gonna be really pissed. I don't know, I might like that. I like French toast. <laughs> what are you, a waffle guy? I am a waffle guy. Yeah. I had a feeling. I like me some waffles. You sloppy bastard. I, am. I like chicken and waffles. Thank you. I bet you do. I do, I love chicken. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, what the fuck is happening? Really? Oh, that's, All oh, okay. of that. The box was open and then she closed it. My bad. All of that to lock a box. Whoa! I think I'm what black. The fuck is wrong with her face? Oh my god! Very very weird style. No. Pupils. Oh okay, I am playing. Holy shit! No pupils. So we are up. Down. We uh, are. Oh wait, are... I have hands. I have boobs. Oh my god, I have heaving bosom. We are strong. Wait, is she like weapon. hyperventilating or something? What the fuck is happening? I think that's just the way she breathes for some reason. We are a strong, independent black woman. Yep. With the uh, coin purse. With the coin purse. And what's in our coin purse? Let's find out. Is it a lighter or it's an a, inhaler? It's oh, a it's lipstick. lipstick. I thought it was an inhaler for a second. Let's get pretty. Oh yeah. What a determined look right. for putting on lipstick. We're going to catch us a husband right now. <laughs> Don't forget to wash your hands, man. What is wrong with you? I'm gonna pee first. No, you. Uh, no. Can, can she already... pee standing up? Nobody nope. puts on lipstick and then goes to use the toilet. I'm fairly certain. Well, I can't. Oh, wash that's my unsanitary. Hands. I can't do anything. <sighs> Let me just leave. Wait, was I in the men's room? No, you're in the women's room. So we have okay. some empty hallway. Shit's getting real. Listen to this I... fucking music. Spooky. 
I think somebody's about to die. Why do I move so slow? Because you're wearing heels, man. God damn it. You're not sprinting. Where do you get those sprinting heels? <laughs> like springs in them? Yeah. Like slinky brand stilettos? Yeah. Be like fucking Inspector Gadget style. By the way, if any of that sounds like a good idea, trademark. <laughs> Just saying, you heard it here first. Guys. Uh, what? We're gonna check out that guy's bald spot. What the fuck is happening? Uh, Am I getting onto an assembly line? No, we're uh, sniffing that guy's butt, and then we're walking into this very, very. It kind of looks like we're getting ready to go into like a, a ship and get dropped off. This is a questionably lit room. Right. It's like that. It's like an MIB where they erase all your shit. <laughs> it's like they ran out of light bulbs and they had to go to like a Halloween supply store. <laughs> like that's the only one they had. Um. Okay. Oh. Oh. oh okay. Wait. Why is it lit like that? That's horrifying. Yes, I am the best. I am the best that ever was! Let me jump up off of you. Uh, apparently this game begins with our America's Got Talent audition. Yeah. Those are some bright bulbs. Uh, am I dying all of a sudden? No, we got our badge from Alfred Pennyworth. What the fuck is happening? Uh, what? What the fuck is happening? Alright, we need to take a deep breath and figure this shit out, okay? Oh, so, fuck. apparently you were dreaming, and we were in an apartment building. I think I'm in a dream or, uh, kind of thing or, now. No, yeah, it's an apartment building. You're in your apartment, I guess? I'm assuming. You have a, just an unnecessary amount of computers. It's just the one. You have a sweet little... No, they have two. No, that's a television. Yeah, that's a TV, man. What's on the floor? Are those books just stacked up or what? Maybe a VHS. There's a PlayStation 2. You know. I can't crouch. <laughs> decided to give off. This game has an undecidedly low amount of buttons. It, it has four. And creaky ass doors. So I like how. Okay. Oh, hey there, boo boo! Um, why is everything still. Is he gonna have a crazy face? Why is everything still boxes? That's you. you. Um. Zool, motherfucker! Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a crazy nightmare. Oh no. Uh, I hit that. Motherfucker! <laughs> fucking 1990s fucking clock. You know how you fix this? Uh, no. I don't. Bro. You throw them just bomb, <laughs> bomb it through the window. Howdy, neighbor. Slam. Okay, that was the most inappropriately packed moving box I've ever seen. Like, three books. Okay. Wow. We're, uh, we are... Apparently, we are magicians. Okay, so I didn't edit that. No, it literally just open, closed, dressed. Like, we are... Um, uh, magicians, actually. We're an FBI Man. wizard. When you become an FBI agent, you all of a sudden are just like super magic. Yes. Magic man. What is with the lipstick? I don't understand. She doesn't put it on this hat, throws it out even. Uh, no. I don't need to look pretty. <laughs> Fuck conformity. <laughs> <laughs> I am not a pretty woman. I'm a warrior. And then just fucking takes it back out and puts it on her under her eyes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the nineties takes, takes the fingers and like smears it down. The nineties movie tropes. <laughs> well, dude, I mean, like, tell me they aren't doing a bunch of tropey shit right now. They kind of are, yeah. Kind of are. Oh God! Quit with the jump edits. Which is weird because like this game isn't even really ramped up yet, and it's just full of jump scares. <laughs> And by jump scares, I mean mildly irritating sequences. Oh, that's the scariest part. It's it said first, Monday. It is the first day. And you have a... What is that? I don't know. And what is up with the fucking... It looks like a, tr like a sculpture made out of a Trisket. 
I want to make a word of that, but I can't come up with anything. This is the mini game where you try to figure out who farted in the elevator. It was <laughs> definitely bald guy. No, it was me. It was it was you. <laughs> Don't tell me I have to figure out which desk is mine. Because uh, <laughs> fuck that. Apparently not. I hope it's the big office at the end. Please, let it be the big office think, at the end. I think they're just going to monorail you. Nope, because I'm moving. <laughs> and I do believe it's the big office at the end. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Uh, there's somebody there. Okay, well maybe I can talk to him. Or not. Office of the assistant director. Maybe I'm supposed to go His to office is huge. Right? But it is the FBI, so you gotta kind of assume. But his office is like bigger than my apartment. A lot of things are bigger than your apartment. Hi, Creeper. What are you looking at? Oh, you know, police stuff. Can I sit down? Oh, yes, I can. Are you going to talk? Nope. <laughs> Not a word. So this is a uh, vo voiceless game. Special Agent Antar- What the- Okay, quit bouncing. Okay, the objectives of this investigation are not disclosed at this time. Fuck you! <laughs> so we don't know what's going on. Okay, so the idea is pause it when you see that. Yeah, for anyone playing this game- if you see those exposition bubbles, definitely pause that shit, because yeah. apparently you are just not allowed to know what's going on. So I think we're looking for a rogue agent. Maybe. I think we're Jason Bourne. We are, are we Jason Bourne, or are we looking for Jason Bourne? Because I feel like that's not going to end well for us. Okay, I think we're looking for Jason Bourne. I already have concerns. Well, maybe we're the one that catches him. Uh, every one of them thought that, and they all died. That's true. I don't feel very good about that. He was pretty badass, right? <laughs> and beyond the fact that we get... We uh, have nightmares in the bathroom. So. Fuck! And teleport. We teleport to... We're nightcrawling. Fuck, man. These jump cuts are killing me. Like super inconsistent locations. But this... I mean, like... Aside of all the bullshit, goddammit, aside of all the bullshit we keep on, like, throwing out and about, the game does look good, and the music it, isn't bad. It, the music's not bad, it's just like... It seems almost inappropriate sometimes. It's This game is so far, and I guess it's gonna lead into it, but it's very confusing, it's very disorienting, and maybe yeah. that's the point, but so far it's just been super disorienting with all the jump cuts, and the lack of exposition. But it works for us. It <laughs> works, but to some extent, but... It's still confusing. Um, Welcome to your giant office. Where we're. Do I, oh, yeah, I cast the shadow on it? I give them props for that. <laughs> right. We're apparently, according to the slideshow, we are looking for George Takei. Boop. And <laughs> I'm not sure why, but we are. Hello. Good evening. <laughs> no, apparently not. Hey, bitch. Whoa. Red file? ruh -roh. Is she stealing documents? Oh. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Whoa, hey! Apparently she's not stealing them, but she is definitely driving the car. She... Ooh! The radio! Yeah. This is apparently the only... Yeah. Apparently, uh... Hey! Creepy, Whoa, another jump cut. Creepy orchestral music is apparently um, the only thing that plays in the radio. If anyone can confirm that, please do. Well, you know, you know they say Silent Hill is based out of Virginia, so... I... I get it, kind of. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Apparently this is what plays on every radio station. Maybe that's a game we should play. Silent Hill, one of them. There's only like two dozen. There's only like a thousand of them. We're in Kingdom... Just arrived. Kingdom Come. And uh, we're apparently going to drive over a fence. <laughs> we are parked really far away from the city. Like, I think we should rethink our parking situation slightly. Fuck. <laughs> Never mind. 
country music. I forgot we can teleport. Ooh, coffee's only 25 cents a cup. Come around here often? <laughs> Not even eye contact. Such a, such a, this is the worst date ever. That's so angry. Thanks for the bail, bitch! Like, that was so... Where is your hospitality, woman? I can't read that. Waitress, how much is this? My eyes don't have pupils. I need your help. Um, wait, what's happening? Oh, okay. Okay, so there's the missing boy. Yeah, I was right. There's missing kids. Okay, uh, mystery solved. <laughs> it is over. It's a, this is a ginger Catholic priest. And there's a missing little boy. Um, Damn, they really sure did take that, you know, and run with it. Is it just me, or does this kind of feel like a Stephen King novel? I don't want to make that. <laughs> I don't want to make the joke, but, you know, it's right there. Oh, wait. Is it their son? And he just happens to be the priest that's there to talk to the grieving mother? I hope. Yeah, I do too. <laughs> Alright, so what am I doing? Am I looking around? Hi, Jim. Bill. <laughs> Let's go check out the guest room, apparently. <laughs> Maybe? Is it a guest room? I guess. I don't know. Ooh, I gotta go put on some lipstick. Yeah, we don't have lipstick. <laughs> Remember, we threw the lipstick away. I know, but it's the only thing so... I know. It's the only thing I know to be real. Lucas. Let me in. Okay, so this okay. is playing for a kid's room. Right, so what we've discovered is, is that he ran away because he has no fun. Oh, there it is. Oh. Uh, he's got a... He's got a telescope. Which seems odd to me. And this whole situation seems weird. We should probably think about... What is up with that pipe? Is there a room behind this? Look on, look down. That's a, that's the light. Isn't it? Um, uh, maybe? What am I missing? I don't know. What the, what, what's happening? Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's a, there's a door here. W okay. So. Oh, he did photography. I thought he just smoked a lot of weed. <laughs> Leave himself a little little dang hunt. So what was he? You know, because what eight-year-old doesn't need an opium den? <laughs> yeah, so let's take a look and see what he was photo t t photographing. Trust me, I'm, like, clicking on everything. You might be able to furiously hear me clicking button. What is happening? Oh, there we go. There's a diary. Lucas. <coughs> oh, is, we're driving again. This is Ledger. That was a direct hit, my bad. Fuck! That's a fucking buffalo. What is a buffalo doing in Virginia? That is a great idea. Why is there a fucking buffalo? And what is wrong with its legs? Just a little drunk. We are no longer allowed to play with the radio. On the road again. Alright, so this is when the cars come to life and start attacking us. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you ever see that movie? What, Maximum Overdrive? Yep. <laughs> yeah. This is the part where... Uh... Isn't that movie awful? It kind of looks like... Actually, it looks more like a, the, the, the beginning of the movie is Splinter. <laughs> Which, if you have not seen it, just don't save, save yourself some time. Let's fiddle around in the glove box. Or not. No, there's something up there. Ooh, Big Rico's. <sighs> oh, she goes to Big Rico's. <laughs> that sounds like a gay strip club. <laughs> it's not. It's actually a pizza. It's a gay pizza. It's a gay pizza? <laughs> It's a gay pizza. <laughs> it's, it's, we're, we're really just reading, <laughs> we're reading this menu right now. Oh, 
we man. just stole the menu. I am the most awesomest. Well, fuck. She's like, I don't know. Ooh, is that a beard trimmer? <laughs> uh, maybe? Uh, isn't this illegal? Maria Halperton. Maria Ortega. There's... what? Maria. Maria. Ay, Dios mio. Sup? Well, hi, buddy. Yeah? Oh, okay, cool. Bye. You know I can arrest you. Ay, Dios mio. Maria. <laughs> Maria, why did you leave me? Uh. Uh. What's happening? So bad. This is such a surreal experience. Yeah, like day I two. Don't understand. Husting. You know, I just don't know what's wrong with the city. God, it's such a weird perspective. Look at my toes. Can we check out the? the check out the. Rico Suave's journal. Why don't we uh, we'll do that next time? Good idea. All right. So we actually have a spot where we can stop. Yeah. Next next episode, we will be looking into uh, Lucas's Lucas's diary and kind of seeing what happens on Tuesday in this whacked game. Yeah, this game's weird. <laughs> All right. Well, till next time, folks. Bye bye. bye. You want to just move into the next one? So it's uh... All right. Let's do it. Uh, you or me? Mm. I'll do this one. Right. Welcome back, folks. It's Dodge Roll Gaming, and we're taking a look into Virginia. Uh, this is episode two. Duh. And we are on day two, Tuesday. We're sitting in our Oh home. my god, what is with that perspective? I know, right? Her fucking head's like tilted all the way oh, downward. She's, we are apparently Linda Blair. And we are sitting in our hotel. No, 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 no. No, we're the woman from Superman 2. Or no, no, from Superman. You remember the, the woman that went crazy? Uh, vaguely. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about, though. Vaguely. It's been a little while. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, we're just sitting it, it here works. <laughs> in, in our apartment checking out uh, Lucas's diaries. Yeah, let's I see. I think where we're picking up at. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> There's a bookmark. Canyon Observe. Visit Canyon Observatory Science Center. Right. So the dude was into... Aliens. Yup. Called it. <laughs> really? It's gonna be aliens? Kit's pretty good. <laughs> oh, we're Whoa. having an out-of-body experience. Whoa. Whoa. Um... Okay. Am I another black woman? No, we are a specter right now. We are an, I mean, out of body experience, and we're gonna go over to back to the thing. You know, in stressful situations, you yeah, shouldn't just, smoke. Just smoke a doob. That's what, <laughs> what you have to do. You're like, is she? Cause that's not how normal people hold cigarettes. <laughs> oh no, we're having a dream again. What the fuck? What the fuck? He is hammering... Lucas's door shut. Yeah. What the fuck is happening in this game? And Zul came back. And he, it, <laughs> that's what it is, Lucas is Zul. That's what it is. Zul confirmed. Is this like, is this a, What? What is happening? Why is... Why am I with the assistant director? Oh, snap. <laughs> ran over Maria. What the... The buffalo's in the house now. I want to go home. Hi. 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 What do you want to talk uh, about? Uh, is Jesus here? <laughs> so, uh... <laughs> this is a buffalo hanging out. What the fuck is happening? Apparently, the main character uh, does 
us a lot of drugs. Um, oh, okay. Well, hello, General Tight Pants. General McSaggy Ass. <laughs> General Mick Elastic Nuts. Let's just stop this right now. <laughs> Let's stop right now. Helper. 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 So this is Maria's office. This is the, uh, yeah, this is Maria. And Ooh, shiny. There's a... a locket with... Person inside? Uh-oh. Maria. She's upset. Alright, I'll leave. Fuck you. I just wanted to see if you want to go get chilies. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> bye! You know, I said sorry a hundred times. <laughs> nope, we gotta go out to the rock quarry. And, uh, this is, looks a lot like this is the place from the journal. Yeah. Uh, you know what this kind of reminds me of? What? It. Maybe? <laughs> like, if it was if it was made by the same people that did Wind Waker, <laughs> then we're pretty much on, this, on the same level right now. Well, this is a wacky comedy. Okay. Um. Bird! <laughs> Where are you, you devil? Oh, what's in there? Well, hello there, Cardinal. I will free you. Be free? Did it, is it in a cage? Yes, yeah, in a cage. Really friendly for a bird, shit. Just <laughs> snaps his neck. Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> <laughs> I think he crushed her in the bird! Wait, our view is askew. You have to drink the cocoa. It'll open your eyes. Oh, she's alive! How? Just how? I have a feeling one of these times we're going to sip the cup, look a little bit heavier into it, and then we'll be jump cut. Oh, wait, wait. I, I had it. There we go. Wait, why is he so happy? <laughs> I have no idea. Fuck, I think there's another dream sequence. Copy? Nope. What? Why? They're trying to bring it back to life. Uh. Whoop, well, it's evil. It needs to die. <laughs> Necromancy! So we are currently, apparently, playing an alien necromancer. Job well done, soldier. <laughs> That's very distant pop music. Yeah. Are we just hanging out, or can we follow her? Oh, shit. Yeah. Fuck. I forgot I was playing a game. <laughs> Wait, there's a bunch of kids here. Uh, a cult. Was this... The spot? This was a cult. Did they call it the G spot? We're seeing a boombox because people carry those around. What the fuck is happening? That's the guy that gave us the finger earlier. Okay, seems a little unreasonable, but uh. 
<laughs> no! Oh no! Dick move, bruh! I, I want to help. Oh, shit. Things could have gotten rough. Who in the fuck carries a switchblade? This is the 90s. No ID, no nothing. Oh, hey, there was something in there. Millennium Mall. Oh, I thought it was M&M's. Dominion Construction. Dominion Constructing. Constructing. Construction. And then Ooh, there's, a, there's a gum wrapper or something. Oh, I thought it was that. Actually, is it? <laughs> is it? Yep. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> That's LSD. She took it. What? Oh, getting it sampled. That is most assuredly LSD. Come on, I just want to play CSGO. <laughs> Come on, man, do math. Can't I just sit down? <laughs> Game world demands you go to bed. <laughs> Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? Oh, no, wait. Turn around. There it is. Uh, that's a giant key. The LSD and something else. Oh, your FBI. Beach. And close up. <laughs> Not a good way to pass out. Wednesday. So do we want to... Uh... No, let's try to fit in two days. Put in some two days. Here. Working overtime. Because we're working overtime. Huh. Okay. Ominous rhythmic beat. <laughs> Is it a road flare? What are we looking at here? It's the fucking buffalo again. Are these missing? Lucas D. Fairfax. Oh. It's a child sized incinerator. Hmm. The, f the demon bird again. Can you necromancy this one again? No, it was... What the fuck? I'm back here again. What the fuck? Okay, just for anybody else who's like thinking about making a game, stop with jump cuts. Yeah, that's it's strictly unnecessary. I have little to no idea what's going on. It partly it's the jump cuts. And partly it's the buffalo. Because <laughs> there's like a fucking buffalo that keeps showing up places. Tarver and Special H. Select your queen. Helper. Helper. Halperin. One entry fact. Maria. Maria Helper. Special agent active. 
previous tiles on 3-4-19. Maria Ortega. Huh. Is it the same person? I guess. Wait, there's two of them found. Yeah, but. Fire, Fire transferred. transferred. Same person, then. Not in database, please refer to the records department. Could it be like a sister, you think? Or a mother? Hmm, I don't know. It's whoever was in the locket. You'd think. Optimistic music. Ooh, we're working with some microfilm right now. Holy shit. I'm going old school. Fucking real to real. I don't even think they do this anymore. Well, my microfilm? I'm sure they do. Yeah, but I, I have a feeling that everything's been like updated since then. Nah, no, you'd be surprised. Like, I feel like some places still have it. Okay. Oh, there we go. Uh, distinguished Special Agent Judith Ortega. From the Bureau's intake, uh, go getting female agents was the award of the FBI Medal uh, for notorious achievement for extraordinary work cracking the Holliston Lidecker case. Yes. During her time with the FBI, the plucky young wife and mother of one has set a high watermark amongst her lady kind of contemporaries. The reporter feels Ms. Ortega is fast establishing herself as a role model for law-abiding colored women everywhere. Mr. Albert Ortega said he was, or he saw his moral influence reflected in his wife's achievement. Director Hoover was not in attendance, but it said, or is said, to be encouraged by the work of the Bureau at large. Superior circulation. The Ortega woman continues to make wild allegations regarding conspiracy against supposed breaches of the ethical guidelines as I am concerned how her superior findings might be interrupted or interpreted. interpreted were they to reach the public at large. The reputation, mine, and that of the Bureau must be safeguarded. Board understanding that this understands this, and I will. I value his cooperation with this sensitive matter. It's common knowledge internally that, whilst sanctioned by applied sciences, Ortega has a what is it, election for unconventional methods. I feel like this could be turned to our advantages, were were deniability to be an issue. So it looks like they're trying to kill this one. Maybe they did. Or perhaps they did. Maybe. And that looks like a death certificate. Y'all. Suspenseful violence. Confidential. Secret. All information contained herein is classified. Are we, are we gonna take it out? Nope. We're here again! Yep. Oh look, it's Leisure Suit Larry. <laughs> what? Really? Um, bring home the bacon. That is ridiculous. Speaking of bacon, can I get some? 
jump in three, two, one. No? All right. Boop. There it goes. <laughs> hey, you had to give it a minute. Listen, I'm sorry. Your mother was a great cat. <laughs> she was also a buffalo. Well, it was a certain incline. <laughs> Look at the grass! Well, there's a lot of just dead, dead, deadness. This game is all just sounds and visuals. <laughs> Which I guess is fair if you have some kind of like applicable storytelling, but there's really not. Like, I don't. Like, I mean, you, you can pretty much put stuff together all on your own. Kind of, but. There should not be a flower there. I'm just growing up out of the flower floorboard. It's a weird flower. Yeah. Can I go up the stairs? You wanna? Oh, I can't. I don't know how legs work. I forgot how to legs. Ooh, door. Nope, can't door. <laughs> Can we do anything? This what place has been abandoned. Do? What does she do? This place was abandoned. Yeah, but she did a thing. She's doing a thing. She kneeled down for a second. I'm gonna try and go up the stairs. Nope. Oh, hey, this is what I was supposed to do. Holy shit. Squeaky gate. Jumped cut. <laughs> uh oh. Ruh row. Damn! Ginger trying to do something bad. Who are arresting you for being a redhead? <laughs> Not with your pale, gingery hands up. I don't think you're supposed to do that! Madam, madam, I'm going to have to ask uh, you not to. Okay. Um, this escalated. It's a lock picking. Thing. Oh, God, I thought it was something else. Yeah. But why don't she plant the evidence on you? Because she's a bitch. God, she feels like she knows exactly where she's going. Oh, no, 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 I know what this is. This is the parents' room. What am I supposed to do? I don't have prompts. <laughs> oh. On the lookout! Don't worry. I have this door or this window <laughs> covered. Okay. Is there something here for me? <laughs> Apparently not. Shall I go back to Lucas's room? There was something at the end of the hall. That is a dark, dark, dark hallway. Was that game or was that you? I, I think it was me. <laughs> I'm a little curious, like, why it sort of funneled you in this direction. Desk. Lamp. <laughs> Bulbous poop <laughs> on. Really? <laughs> what is this? It looks like a cigar case. It kind of looks like one of the boxes from the very beginning. Remember the oh, yeah, the lockbox. Lock. Fucking job cut! <laughs> that seemed important. You have to get out of the car. I can't. I'm stuck in the car. You totally now teleport. I'm out of the car. <laughs> totally teleport. Oh, 
Okay. Oh. Apparently she wants to get fucked. Or, or, she's trying to pick up a lead. I'm gonna go with get fucked. Uh, isn't that the bartender from Wolf Among Us? <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> Apparently she moved from Apparently fucking... Apparently she's got multiple jobs. So, well, not multiple jobs, just multiple places of employment. Oh, okay. This is a bartender and boat! Well, hello! Can I get up there and, uh, pokey oogie oogie? So I can't pokey no more? <laughs> <laughs> um, no. Just because you said pokey oogie oogie. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but my references are getting gradually older. <laughs> like that weird black man. Perfect. You're creepy! Dur da dur da dur. I dur. Wait, he's not even holding a glass. Do you like extra chromosomes? Because I has them. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck is happening? Am I supposed to find a chair? What am I... What, what's happening? <laughs> um... Oh, wait, hey, hey, there it is. There it is. Okay, sit here. <laughs> Uh oh. Hey, creeper. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. It is just like that lock box. Duh! What the fuck? Um. Um. You'll find a dead bird in a box and just dance her off. What the fuck? What the f- Really? <laughs> Who cares? It's not like we're on the job or anything. There it is. All right. Well, I think that's pretty much it for this episode. Next time, we're going to find out <laughs> what happens on Thursday, but... Uh, as of right now, we know very little, except there's a dead bird, and a buffalo, yeah. and a cigar box. Yeah, they really are, like, kind of trying to intensify stuff. Right, it's getting really weird, and yeah. uh, we're going to see where it goes in the next episode. So, until then... Bye! bye. What's, in the, what's in the jacket? What's in the box? And... ta -da. <laughs> Come on. Timely reference! Oh! <laughs> okay. Um. So you were saying, what's in the box? <laughs> what's in the box? Not a Monday. Who was she? I thought I knew everyone. A working girl. A working girl? A working girl? I don't. I mean, I am a working girl. <laughs> She's a blanking gale. Three prostitutes in a couple of hours. I'm doing good.